Thousands of flights have been canceled since Christmas Eve, in part due to the COVID-related staff shortages. At Miami International Airport, the airport reported 19 canceled arrivals and 14 canceled departures today. Fort Lauderdale showed 11 flights canceled as of this afternoon. CBS 4's Dina Demetrius has a look at the impact the cancellations are having across the nation. The holiday hustle and bustle is more like a drag. It's very frustrating and we have plans already. We have a business to run and stuff like that. So now Patel's return flight to Kentucky isn't getting off the ground. It was uh, for 924 and got delayed, delayed and went to one o'clock and all of a sudden got canceled. The Omicron driven surge is forcing more flight cancellations with infections among pilots, crew and airline staff. According to FlightAware, more than 1,000 flights with U.S. destinations were canceled Monday and more than 3,000 were delayed. Airlines can't operate flights without the required number of pilots and flight attendants. Safety comes first. Now several airlines are calling on the CDC to update its COVID guidance for the fully vaccinated and reduce the quarantine isolation period from 10 days to five for breakthrough cases. Honestly, if it's good enough for hospital workers, for nurses and doctors, I think it should be good enough for the airline industry as well. While the disruption is certainly a hassle, experts say it should resolve itself when the holiday rush dies down. Once the airlines can stabilize their schedule for the next five days, then for the first quarter of 2022, it should be relatively okay. In the meantime, travel experts advise signing up for text alerts so you'll be notified immediately of any changes to your flight. And of course, pack your patience. Dina Demetrius, CBS News, Los Angeles. Well, it's not just U.S. airlines impacted by the pandemic. German airline Lufthansa is canceling 10% of its winter flights. That equals to 33,000 flights. The company's CEO is blaming it on a sharp drop in bookings.